I recently learned that I'm somewhat of a sniper when it comes to throwing axes at things. I went axe throwing for the first time in my life just a couple days ago, and on my second throw, I hit a bullseye on the target, and then I was very, very consistently accurate with my two-hand throws of the axe, and was surprisingly good, surprisingly quick. And this isn't something that's super uncommon for me. In just about everything that I try, I typically pick it up and become really good a lot faster than is probably normal. And that's not me trying to brag a ton, but I mean, no one's gonna brag for me, so I might as well do it myself a little bit. And I wanted to create a word for that type of experience because, well, I mean, that's just what I do here. So that's what we're gonna be talking about in our word creation, is when you can pick up a new skill extremely quick and you're just kind of really good at like everything that you try and it usually happens extremely quickly too. You just have the knack for picking up new skills. And one of the people that I wanted to spotlight in this creation is Anthony Edwards. Probably my favorite NBA player. I'm of course a Timberwolves fan and uh, I really enjoy Anthony Edwards' personality. And he's also a tremendous basketball player. But it doesn't just stop there. Ant seems to think that he could be amazing at basically everything that he touches. Like he's shown great football talent. He thinks that he could be a great baseball player. And I believe him. I'm not gonna say he wouldn't be. Like, it seems like this dude's talents are just like never ending. I think he's also like a great bowler too. Like, like I said, just, he is an extremely talented human being, and you can just pick up things and be great just like it's like it's nothing. And I'm not saying I'm at that level at all. I just like I can pick up a lot of different things and be good very fast. Doesn't mean I'm gonna be unbelievable at everything I do. Usually I have to put a ton of effort to be amazing at something, but I can be like above average basically instantly at stuff. At least that's kind of how I feel. But for describing someone that is able to be kind of good at everything and it happens very fast, very easily for them, I wanted the word to be talented, which is essentially the word talented, but we're replacing the two E's with A's. So it's all A's for vowels in this word. And the base is talented because that's the core of the word is that you're great at picking up all these talents and you're a person that has all these different talents. And then we replace the initial ENT with ANT because that's Ant, as in Anthony Edwards, that's his nickname, Ant. And he is a perfect example of this, so he gets recognized in the word. And then the ending of the word is T-A-D, Tad, and Tad basically just means like a little bit, and it's kind of all about just needing a little bit of experience to become really good at something super fast. And that sums up everything for what I want to describe, so the new word is Talented. And that's gonna do it for the Daily Do. Let's move on to our comment of the day. Comment of the day probably is someone that's quite talented, and that's Peyton Boom. Peyton Boom said, busy with who? On my last video, because I said I was busy with things, so I didn't have a ton of time to make videos. However, it's because I was busy with Peyton Boom, who commented this as well as Gavin and other Gavin, just having a nice little fun mini vacation. And Peyton's a pretty talented person as well. And she was actually probably the next best axe thrower from when we went. And like her first three or six throws were pretty brutal. And then by the end, she was just killing it and didn't really miss anything. So she really picked it up super fast as well. And also as a commenter on this channel historically, she scored extremely high on her first comment ever. So that's just another demonstration, I suppose. However, this one uh, can't say is of that caliber. Gonna have to give quite a bit lower of a score on this one. Gonna be a 24 out of 75 because we have 24 hours left together before you guys have to leave. And actually, it's probably quite a bit different than 24 hours, but we basically have a day left. Anyway, song of the day. Song of the day is Bitter Fuck by Joji. And this one is probably up there for my favorite Joji songs. I actually really like this song. Again, probably, yeah, pretty depressing, somewhat abrasive, but extremely honest, and that's something that I 
really love to hear in music, and this is a song that I think is awesome. Then for the video of the day, the video of the day is Fergie singing the national anthem at the NBA All-Star Game a couple years back just because this is an absolute train wreck and something that I get a ton of joy from because it's, it's just so bad, but entertaining because of it. And that's something that is one of my favorite things is when things are so bad that it's also very funny. And when you hit that sweet spot of cringe, there's just about nothing better. That'll do it for the Daily Do. Peace out.